Right, Emma Gibson here. Um, we've just had our to tortilla wrap with cheese and pizza topper with sausage inside. Very nice. So we've grilled, we've fried, now we're going to toast some marshmallows. So fire's dying down. There's a little bit of a flame in the middle where the stick's still going. I'm going to look for the nice white hot embers for toasting the marshmallow. I'm going to move the dog out of the way. Um, I'm going to sit in the respect position. We don't need gloves when we're toasting marshmallows, but we need to remind children to hold the stick like a sparkler on bonfire night and make sure that they don't put it right on the fire because they'll have ash all over the marshmallow and don't put it in the flames because it will burn as well. Um, when working with children, it's really important that we, we have a, a routine of how many children sit around the area. So for here, you could probably fit one on each side um, and remind children that quickly the marshmallow could toast. <laughs> so make sure you're not doing too much talking and concentrate on what you're doing. Gently turn it round. And you're looking for the nice brown toasted effect of the marshmallow. If we were feeling um, greedy, we could get some nice chocolate digestive biscuits to put the marshmallow inside. Oh, s'mores. A little bit, nice bit of s'mores always goes down well. Um, just needs to keep spinning it until you're ready. I find a very good tip with the s'mores is do it just before the children go home, before they yep. start bouncing. Yeah, lots of sugar. <laughs> and again, food around a campfire, one of the biggest reasons we do it is it's to fuel the children. If you're out all day in the woods, keep them warm, keep spirits high, morale high. And I know I'm already feeling the effects of the cold weather, but I know that this toasted marshmallow will make me feel much better. And then another thing that we do, because the marshmallow is obviously really hot, when we think it's ready, we could give it, I sometimes say 20 blows. Mm -hmm. So we could do, counts 20. It's cold outside anyway. <coughs> so it will, the temperature will drop. Always check it with your finger, clean fingers, that it's okay to go. And then when you're done, the stick, if you've got a nice wooden stick like this, it could go in the fire. And then you know, nobody's gonna get, Cut away the sharp sticks and they're not going to be lying around. Okay, marshmallow time. Come on, Emma, you've got to have a bite. <laughs> oh. That's a good sign, you've not got them. <laughs> 